Finally, our heroes came to far, far away. Fiona's parents were quite curious to see what their new son-in-law looked like. Needless to say, Shrek failed to meet the royal expectations. Man, this is taking forever! Hey, if people wanted to read, they'd buy a book, all right? <sighs> to make a long story short, the king and Shrek sniped at each other over dinner. Making Fiona all sad. And suddenly, a fairy godmother appeared. Yeah, you know what, Alistair? I got it from here. She's all like, oh, you can be beautiful again. Just marry my son, Prince Charming. But of course, Fiona's having none of it. Why? Two words. Shrek. So what does this nasty crone do? She goes to threaten the king instead. And the next morning, the king invited Shrek on a hunt. But all was not as it seemed. I, of course, smelled a rat right away. So I figured I'd tag along, you know, just to be on the safe side. Where is everybody? Man, I love hunts. This is gonna be great. But where are they all at? I'm not sure. The king said to meet him by some tree. Oh, of course, a tree. Well, that should be easy. There's only about four million trees in the forest. In fact, I can't even see the forest for all these dead gum trees. I don't know. He must be around here somewhere. You get the feeling that we're being watched. Oh, what was that? Donkey. I seriously doubt there's anything scarier in this forest than an ogre. Uh, ogres? Where? Oh, boy. Hello? Anybody there? I know I saw something that time. Hello out there. Okay, yeah, very funny. Let's scare the donkey. I'm going to check it out. Keep going that way, and I'll catch up with you. And if you see the king, tell him I'll be right there. Okay, but, but don't be long. I don't want you getting scared without me. I'll just keep going now. Deeper and deeper into this dark, creepy forest like the brave, noble donkey that I am. <gasps> what was that? My stress level is very high right now. See these eyes? Welcome to FGM Potions and Potions. Enchanting ideas and bewitching notions. Turn your enemies into not so secret admirers. Freeze your enemies in their tracks. Watch your enemies shrink away. So long and thanks for stopping by FGM Potions and Notions. Ooh, look at those pumpkins. Go over to them and click your left mouse button to pick them up. Click your left mouse button again to throw them before they explode. by kicking that rope over there. Maybe I can get that guy up there to help me. Mm, I fancy some nice fried donkey ears tonight. Okay, maybe not. I'd say this would be the perfect time to use some love potion. Or really any kind of potion, come to think of it. I'm gonna have to go up there and kick that rope down, potion or not. One guy is no match for a donkey with a black belt and button mashing. There's a sparkly mushroom I can bounce on. No! A donkey! Got it! Woo! Yeah, hey, that scared you, didn't it? Donkey! That bale of hay will break my fall nicely. trying to pet me now. So sweet. Never leave me. Well, I need to be hearing some tingling in my pockets before too long. This having no money thing is not working for me.
A wanted poster is yours. You're a champ. What an ace. Every third one sends you off to a magical place. Whoa, what was that? All right, contestant. Race through this level and collect as many coins as you can. You're on a strict time limit, so no clowning around like the rest of the game. Start the clock and go. Two favorite words, bling and bling. Nature and talking donkeys do not mix. What kind of game is the king playing at? I think we've been royally had. Just count me out. Hey man, there's something strange about this place. I've never actually been on a hunt before. Whoa, what was that? Never trust a bush that does that. With any luck, I'll come across another of those wanted poems. Sort of legend has it as a reward. right now. See this eye twitching? How much more abuse do I have to take?
This shrink potion will downsize you in a big way. This shrink potion will downsize you in a big way. Pump it up with this mighty strength potion. Thank you and come back next time you've got some money. Shrek, is that you, man? You better quit kidding around. I guess having roots would make me cranky too. Well, they say money is the root of all evil, but whatever. Hey, you wanna fight or something? Oh, I am good. How did you get into this? Just a beast of burden, I guess. If I see a hero bar, I'm getting it. Period. The end. Semicolon. Make me jump and then press the left mouse button while I'm in the air, and I'll do a jump attack. You save. Oh, me 
paranoid, but I don't like the looks of that tree. With any luck, I'll come across another of those wanted posters. You know, legend has it, there's a reward for getting three of them. Never trust a bush that does that. <laughs> yourself into there, donkey. Oh, man, am I glad to see you. Consecutively? <laughs> oh, Shrek, you cracked me up. So where to? This way, uh, donkey? Little less toward the trap, just a wee bit? Excellent, thank you. Donkey butt across this water. Mm, this is going to take some strategy. Huh. Tracks. 
Good thing I'm not a bear. I guess having one make me cranky too. Clarence mentioned these one time. I can still hear them like it was yesterday. Red is bad, green is good. So I just need to jump on them when they're green.
trick. You hear that? It's quiet. Too quiet? No. Ooh, that was a close one. I'm God. Oh my God, Shrek, help! It's a pirate with a tail and galoshes. Excuse me, I am a musketeer. My name is Puss in Boots. You are a pirate in galoshes. What are you talking about? I look good in this. These boots are Italian leather. They accentuate my enough. I am here to kill the ogre. Prepare to die. You're a silly little kitty. Move left and right to avoid the pirate in galoshes clawing you to death. Come on, Prepare knock him out of his boots. The greatest humiliation of your life. Better bring your A game, little pussycat. Shrek moves in. It's hard to believe a cat and an ogre would be so well matched. But just look at the perspiration. Where's your ship, pirate cat? Ha! I will toy with you like I toy with lizards. Scott, shoo! Something against which to taste my metal. If you're not careful, little fella, you'll be skewered for lunch. Pray for mercy from Puss in Boots. Zip it, Fuzzball. <laughs> Looks like you're the pirate of bruises and sadness now. <laughs> Looks like you're the pirate of bruises and sadness now. When you are ready to meet your maker, let me know. Don't start something you can't finish. All right, Shrek, doing good. Just keep it over there away from me. Doing good, Shrek. Prepare to feel my blades cold, sweet kiss. <coughs> uh, are we supposed to pat him or what? Nah, he's a goner. Let's just watch. Uh, oh, yeah, oh. Ah, gotcha. Who's in the cat box now? You have defeated me, senor. I await your pleasure. You heard the man, Shrek. Pleasure his awaitance. Take him down. Yeah. What? No, donkey. I don't hurt little kitty cats. Yeah, you do. You eat kitty cats for breakfast. You turn them inside out and wear them as hats. You pulverize them. You never. They make scratchy hats and they taste greasy. So be it. Then I must become your faithful companion. Uh, think again, hot sauce, because that job is taken. As repayment for sparing my priceless storied life. After all, I was sent here to kill you. Sent here? By whom? Why, the king, of course. Ah, see, I knew it. I knew it. Never trust a cat who wears mink, Shrek. It's redundant, first of all. Why is the king so against Fiona and me living a happy life together? Oh, well, if all you want is happiness, then you need to see the fairy godmother. The offices of the most eminent one in all the land lie not far from here. Permit me to escort you thence. Do you know how to get there? Si, senor. I have marked that territory many times. Happiness? That's a no-brainer. 